staying in God's love means living in obedience to God's commands. Now, we don't live in obedience to God's commands because we're afraid of God. We live in obedience to God's commands because we believe God wants what's best for us. And God puts guardrails up to keep us from messing up. So we just gotta kind of stay within those guardrails following God's commands. Think about your daily life. Are there areas where you struggle to follow God's commands? Are you ever tempted to step over the guardrail, right? And do what you want to do. Well, that again is not usually going to work out real well for you. If we want to stay connected to God's love, we got to stay within those boundaries. But it doesn't stop there even. If we want to stay in God's love, we got to trust in God's goodness. Even when life doesn't make sense. We need to trust that God is with us and has something good in store for us no matter what we are facing. I wonder how much we really trust God, especially when things get hard. Or do we find it easier to kind of go it alone? We gotta put our trust in God all the time. And then here's where the rubber meets the road. If we're really staying in God's love, it means we're loving others. You see, the love we receive from God isn't just for us. It is meant to be shared with other people. So when we love others as God has loved us, we show the world what God's love looks like. Think about that for a second. If the only thing the people in this world see is how we love them, and that's the only way they're gonna know how much God loves them, are they seeing God's love in the way we love them, or are they seeing us? And I mean, that could be simple. It can be as simple as being kind. It can be listening. It can be helping somebody in need. It can be forgiving others. It can be offering grace to someone who doesn't really deserve it. But by loving others, we let God's love flow through us. So we need to think about how we treat others. Are we sharing with others the same love that God has given to us? Or are we kind of keeping that for ourselves? Because when we let God's love flow through us, man, it can make a positive impact on the lives of the people that we come across every single day. And staying in love with God is something we gotta work on every day. It involves making daily choices to accept that love, to live in obedience, to trust in God's goodness, to share God's love with other people.